In this video, I'm going to show you how to make banana walnut French toast on the Camp Chef Flat Top Grill 600. Mmm, delicious. All right, first you'll need your ingredients. You want some milk, some walnuts, butter, bananas, a little bit of imitation vanilla, three eggs, Texas toast, and some delicious generic Kroger brand syrup to go on top. I'm just kidding. Buy real syrup if you're not cheap like me. I went ahead and mixed all the eggs, the cinnamon, the vanilla together with a little bit of the milk. The actual ingredients will be in the description below. Put them in that little flat um, glass pan there. Gave them a good whip up because this is what I'm going to be dipping all my Texas toast into. Fired up the griddle and I got my sausages down just because I wanted something else to go with it. Took my stick of butter. Got it ready to go for all of these delicious pieces of French toast. You could cut off a little bit of butter and put it on there. I just like to hold the stick on it. Please ignore my sweatpants. Um, I didn't put on real clothes for this because it was early on Saturday morning. And those aren't stains. I painted in those pants. It's hard working sweatpants I have right there. So here's the egg mixture. All the cinnamon's kind of floating on top. You'll see when I dip this first one in here, it kind of sucks up all the cinnamon. So then I kind of had to slide it off a little bit there because I didn't want the first one to just be like cinnamon to a thousand degree or whatever. So I got a little bit of it off. Probably should have gave it a mix with the fork before I did the first one. But yeah, that first one's down and I'm going to go ahead and throw down uh, about four or five more. Ignore the mixing with the finger. This isn't a restaurant. It's just for me and my wife. It's okay. More butter. More Texas toast going down on the griddle. It was a good Saturday morning for breakfast. There we go. I got this little grate on the right side. The right side of my griddle is all the way off because uh, I don't need to make that much. So I just put that grate there, and then sometimes it's good to like put my eggs for when I'm getting ready for my French toast. Or maybe the sausages get done, and I don't want them to be continually on the heat, so I'll put them on that little grate there as well. So I got all six of them down. They went for about four or five minutes, and boy, did they turn out good. It couldn't be any easier of a recipe. This is one of those things that you're like, yeah, this is why I bought a griddle because this French toast is so easy on the big 36 inch surface area. And they just look so good. I mean, it just looks like a wooden in a restaurant or in a diner. Went ahead and touched them sausages. Just see how they're doing. Not quite done. Not ready to flip the last two pieces of French toast yet either. And then boom, plated it. Put some bananas on top, some walnuts, some butter, a little bit of syrup. Doesn't get much better than that, folks. Uh, let me know in the comments below what is your favorite type of French toast. Maybe you like it plain. Maybe you like with blueberry. Maybe you like pumpkin French toast. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more griddle videos, go ahead and check them out on the right side of the screen. Have a good day and keep on cooking.